Thanks for tuning in, football fans. I'm John Kuzma from EndZoneBlog.com. And there's an old saying in football, and it's winning takes care of everything. And that might be the only solution for Antonio Brown and the Oakland Raiders. So it's been a rough offseason for the Oakland Raiders. You know, they sign Antonio Brown, who has been the best wide receiver of the past decade. But there's a riff right now between GM Mike Mayock and Brown. Uh, Mayock fined Brown for missing uh, some of training camp, some of the practices during training camp. And then uh, just recently, I think a couple days ago, uh, Mayock and Brown got into a heated dispute. And right when it looked like the Oakland Raiders were going to part ways with the future Hall of Famer. John Gruden stepped in and admitted that the Oakland Raiders plan on playing Antonio Brown Monday night against the Denver Broncos in their season opener. Now, this isn't too surprising because, you know, John Gruden is in charge of everything. He got that massive contract there. I think it was over $100 million. Um, so he's the guy calling the shots in Oakland, and he just wants to win. Um, you know, winning takes care of everything. And he's hoping that if they go out there and, you know, beat up on a bunch of teams, that hopefully things will work itself out. Um, you know, Antonio Brown will benefit from these regular season games, you know, picking up too, because he is a workaholic and nobody can question his desire to get the best of the guy that's covering him. You know, he, he wants to go out there and perform at a high level. So when everybody's focusing on the next opponent, uh, that's coming up, it, there's less downtime and there's less, uh, free time to get into these little uh, issues that Antonio Brown and the Oakland Raiders have been having. Um, you know, it's been a lot for both sides to go through. Uh, you know, the Raiders feel like, you you know, they handed Antonio Brown this uh, new contract and they, they feel like they need more from him, which is completely understandable. He's got to show up and practice. He's got to take it seriously. Uh, he has to try to avoid being a distraction, but, uh, Antonio Brown kind of feels like on his end of it, you know, he's bringing so much to this team. Uh, he's going to bring publicity to the team. He's going to put fans in the stands. Not only that, above all, um, he is, like I said, the greatest receiver of the past decade and an exceptional talent. He'll probably go for over a hundred yards and two touchdowns in the opener, but, uh, you know, if this team can win, maybe they can get past this rough patch and move forward. But if they start losing games and the team starts to unravel, then this might be just the beginning of the troubles that we're going to see in Oakland. So there's a lot riding on Monday night. Um, everybody wants to see what's going to happen. You know, uh, it's a combustible situation and the stakes are high. I'm John Kuzma. Check out endzoneblog.com.